The waves got worse and she started going out further. And then when the sheriff showed up, she, the waves pulled her out and she started going under. Luck, a miracle, whatever you believe in, a four-year-old girl is alive tonight after she nearly drowned in Lake Ontario this morning, all while her father was asleep, not even aware she'd left the house. Tonight, a Niagara County Sheriff's deputy is being hailed a hero. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Rusak tracked down the woman who called 911. He takes us inside the scary morning. Waves crashed on the shores of Lake Ontario Thursday. The afternoon at Olcott Beach was uneventful. It was a much different story in the morning. And had he not done that, we would have been talking about a death for sure. While her father was sleeping in a house on Main Street, a four-year-old girl with autism snuck out, walked across a field, down a path, and next to the water. The main access point to the beach is locked up. Gloria Privatera was on a walk with her friend. She saw the girl walking on the beach alone. Thank God they saw her. Privatera, who does not want to be on camera, called 911. It almost seemed she was smiling, like playing with us initially, but when she got in and started going under, then he said he could see the fear in her eyes. The girl was 50 yards away from this pier in nearly 10 feet of water. Terrified. Gloria says the waves weren't quite this big yet at the time of the rescue, but they were close. Niagara County Deputy John Vosberg jumped into the water and brought the girl back to shore. The girl was sent to Oshai. She'll be okay. The sleeping father was charged with endangering the welfare of a child. Deputies say he had no idea what had happened and was very upset. As for Vosberg, uh, he just took it in stride and he's like, hey boss, I'm just doing my job. The waves of Lake Ontario were nothing to mess with Thursday, not for anyone, especially a four-year-old. We don't always get happy endings in this job. Today we did. In Olcott, Jeffrey Sachs, 7 Eyewitness News.